Alright, hey Casey, would you step out and talk to us here for a second? No? In Marion, okay. Iowa, these police have no arrest warrant and no probable cause. I need him to go. He's not going to go anywhere, so... No. Yet for trying to close the door... Hey! Come on. Hey! You need to come out. out. Hey! Come dude! Out to us. Step out dude! Here. Dude! Step out here! Dude. Get on the ground. What's on up? the ground. Hey, you're under arrest. What Get on the ground. What's going on? Get on the ground. What's Get on the ground. You're under arrest. For what? For what? harassment. Harassment on what? What the Calling the, the city hall earlier today. Yes, calling city hall earlier in the day. They are arresting and cuffing him not for threatening city hall, just calling city hall and asking for documents. Dude, I've called the FBI, I've called the U.S. Marshals, I've called everybody. Well, that's brilliant. No s***. What's wrong with city hall? You've been warned not to harass them. Dude, that was a year ago on some false harassment. A year ago on false harassment, the man said, and he is correct. Casey, who goes by the social media name Afro Man Audit 365, was arrested at City Hall just over a year before this encounter for allegedly trespassing and harassment. He represented himself at trial and was found not guilty. The judge ruled the city had no right to bar him from City Hall or stop him from doing business there. Now on this day in February 2022, after Casey called City Hall and showed up in person to get public records for use in a civil lawsuit against the police, the cops are arguably retaliating. Casey explains the situation to a friend inside the apartment. Hi, ah, dude, they're arresting me for harassment. Nah, dude, they're literally harassing me for harassment, dude. Where are you this guy's already arrested me illegally and I beat him in court a year ago for him lying in court. We're going to arresting me for standing in public. Calm down, Casey. And now all of a sudden I Where are your shoes? Again? Where wow. are your shoes? Can you grab it? Casey, I'm going to search it. Do you have anything on you you need to be aware of? Don't touch me. I don't give you consent. You're, you're, you're getting searched. Fourth Amendment right. No, no, I don't, well, I don't give consent. Do I don't give... Hey, is there well, bad? You're doing seizures already. Dude! Alright, that's the way they end. You're under arrest. Dude! So your seizures are... I don't give you consent to my... Well, that's consent. I do, actually. No, you don't. So you do For an illegal detainment. Yeah. You're under arrest. Dude, you straight pushed my door open and tackled me. You tried to open the door, and you tried to show your You dipshit. You stepped in there. We're talking, Yep. That's not worth engaging with. The body camera video recently released is intriguing from the moment police approached Casey's building. Under the direction of the police chief and against the judge's ruling, the police are planning to arrest Casey. So we'll wait till 60 gets here. Okay. Just pull up right by that red dumpster just so we aren't blocking the drive. Yeah, okay. And it's kind of off to the side there. But they don't have a warrant because they cannot get one. A female officer new to the force inadvertently reveals the unlawful plan when she asks on camera about Mirandizing Casey. If he's technically what I, I need to Mirandize him before I ask him any questions. She's not under arrest at this point, right? No. Okay. But are we... 160, 10, 23. I'll ask I'm pulling in from First Avenue. No, he's, I mean, he's not under arrest. He can shut the door on us. <laughs> He's not under arrest, he can shut the door on us. That's true. If police are not planning to arrest somebody, that person does not have to talk. Okay. Let's go down and get a warrant for his arrest then. Okay. Uh, yes, generally police can get a warrant. And once police are making a planned arrest, they must warn the suspect he has the right to remain silent. But in this case, where the cops cannot get a warrant, the police are hoping okay. Casey assaults them by closing the door on their feet. We're, we're on camera, okay? We're yeah. live now. So any statement you make, if, if you're going to make a, that statement, then you have to, then you would do have to Mirandize. Yeah. Right? Okay. So we're going to go up and, we're going to go up and get his, we're going to get his side of the story, and okay. we're going to go from there. But the police are not about to get his side of the story. Instead, they put their gloves on for going hands on. Once inside the building, the police decide to have Kylie McCoy, the rookie female officer, make first contact. This way, Casey doesn't feel threatened or suspect anything. Hey, Casey. Hey, Casey, can you come to the door and just talk to me for a second? Okay. Listen, man, it's really important that you come talk to us right now, okay? Who is it, he says. I'm Officer McCoy, I'm with the Marion Police Department. 
I'm sorry, I can't hear you, Casey. What you saying? Oh, okay. Can you come to the door and talk to us? It works. And the police quietly signal to one another down the hallway that Casey is preparing to open the door. All right, hey Casey, would you step out and talk to us here for a second? No? Okay. And I need him to go. He's not gonna go anywhere, so. No. Well, I'm sure hey, 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 hey! Come on. Hey! You need step to come out. Here. Hey, come dude! Out step out dude! Here. Dude! Step out here! Get on the ground! What the on the ground. Fuck? Hey, you're under arrest. What get on the ground! What's going on? on the ground! What's get on the ground! What's going on? You're under arrest! For what? For what? harassment! Harassment on what? What the oh. City Hall earlier today. Dude, I've called the FBI, I've called the U.S. Marshals, I've called everybody. Well, that's brilliant. No shit. What's wrong with City Hall? You've been warned not to harass them. Dude, that was a year ago with some culture. Set them up. Put your legs in, Casey. Oh. We're gonna lift. Okay. Holy shit. I'm gonna stand you up, okay? Yeah. Uh, ow, yeah. ow, Jesus Christ. Do you want shoes, Casey? Uh -huh. I'd like to not f okay. Yes, Casey? yes, shoes at least. Holy f Get your shoes. Jesus Christ. Holy Look at me for the listen to me for, okay. Hey, listen to me for just a second. Is it okay to listen to me for Nah, dude, they're arresting me for harassment. Okay nah, dude, they're literally arresting me for harassment, dude. Where this shoes? guy's already arrested me illegally, and I beat him in court just, a year just, just ago him. for him lying in court. We're going to arresting me for standing in public. Just calm down, Casey. Don't touch me. I don't give you. You're, you're getting searched. Get Fourth Amendment, right? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't give you. Fourth Amendment. Well, you're that's being that's seized that's already, so we're going to search you. Okay. Dude. All right. That's the way that it is. You're under arrest. Dude. So your seizure has already been done. You don't need to give us consent. I do, actually. No, you don't. So you need to read For the law a little bit more. It's yeah. not illegal. You're under arrest. Dude, you tried pushing my door open and tackled me. Oh, you what do tried, you mean? You opened the door and you tried shutting it on you us. You did shit. You stepped okay. in there. We're done talking, okay? Yeah. Put your Come shoes on. on. It's not worth it. All right, we're going. Let's go. On the way to the squad car, Officer Joseph Chapman roughed up Casey, causing him to lose a shoe. This happens if you play games, right? This is what happens if you play games. Get it here. How am I supposed to walk? With your feet. Dude. One leg in front of the other. That's how you're taught when you're kid, right? At this point, right? Casey looks Dude. at Officer Chapman, yeah. and Chapman becomes even angry. You turn and face me again, you have a bigger problem. You understand that? Do you understand me? Yes, dude. One leg in front of the other. Sit down. Turn around and face me. What did he do? He turned around and faced me. Try to headbutt you? What? Did he try to headbutt you? No, he just tried to turn you. <laughs> you good? Yeah. Let's go shut the door. Casey was booked on five counts of harassment and held briefly at the local jail before being released on his own recognizance. Legal experts call the charges against him absurd. Furthermore, the experts say the body camera videos clearly establish that the police committed assault and battery, kidnapping, and violated Casey's first, fourth, and 14th Amendment rights. And all because Casey, Afro Man Audit 365, previously humiliated police in court, got his rights affirmed and started asking City Hall employees for documents and information relevant to a potential lawsuit against police. Over the past several years, I've reported on a lot of horrific law enforcement departments and shameful cops, but the officers in Marion, Iowa, from the chief on down, are clearly among the worst. One can only hope that Casey brings a lawsuit that literally bankrupts that city. In the meantime, the police are not commenting on any of this. To be clear, I'm sure there are some good people in Marion, Iowa, and perhaps there are even a few city employees who honor information requests and public access as the law requires instead of freaking out. Still, the good people in Marion deserve far better than city workers who are ignorant and far more than a tyrannical police department that is rotten to its core. I'm David Schuster. Thanks for joining us.